How best to get inside? Scale the wall and... Oh, that's not good. I'll never make that jump. I need to find another way. did apologize for knocking me over. No! Va bene, where to? The water. That doesn't exactly narrow it down. <sighs> Wait. Ah, Christ, on my leg. I never did catch your name. Rosa. Honorato Rosa, Amezio. No. Hugo! What's this? Rosa's been wounded. Pass her here. We'll go the rest of the way in the boat. Careful. Go! I'll deal with the guards. They're all over the... Dead, idiota! Say a prayer later! Porco I need to see... Uh, I need to see Antonio! Uh, Be uh, careful! Let uh, me do it! Go and find Antonio! Mr. Hugo, do what he says! Qual l'ultimo arrivato dagli ordini! Where's Antonio? Make yourselves useful! Clear a space for her! Oh, they've sent for help. Thank you. Rosa, what's happened? Just get this out of me. Soon, soon. Let's have a look first. Clean entry and exit through the thigh. That's good. Get it out! Rosa, we must take care not to... Now! Come away. Tenetela. I'm sorry, Piccola. Sorry! Ficatelo nel culo, you're sorry! Go fetch Bianca and be quick. Help me with this. How? Take a clean piece of linen. When I remove my hand, press the cloth into her room. Are you ready? Now! Uh, ben Fabio, uh, you work well under pressure. Uh, uh, She's spirited this one. Porca puttana! Avanti! Get Rosa inside so that Bianca can close the wound. You'll be all right. The worst is past. Ti venisse il cancero, brutto bastardo! A te che la grandissima troia di tua madre! Thank you. Rosa is most dear to me. If I had lost her... I've always had a soft spot for women in distress. So I've heard. Don't look so surprised. We know all about you, Ser Ezio. Your work in Florence and the rest of Tuscany. Good work, too. If a little... unrefined. Then you know why I'm in Venezia. I can guess. When you have a minute, come see me in my office. There's something we should discuss. Avanti. Hey. Prego. Can I offer you something? Biscotti. Un café. What's café? An interesting concoction brought to me by a Turk merchant. Here. Have a taste. A little bitter, if you ask me. Just seems lacking somehow. I don't know. Have you considered adding sugar, maybe? Or latte? I suppose it's something of an acquired taste. Enough about that. Now, where were we? Our failure at the Palazzo cost us dearly. It will take time to recover. No doubt Emilio will use this pause to strengthen his defenses and continue his oppression of the district. You may not share our motive, but I know you share our goal. Why not gather your forces and try again? To act in haste would only bring more losses. No, we must resupply and draw new plans. Get 
can ill afford to sit around and wait. Nor would I want you to. Work with us instead. Already my men begin to mend today's wounds. Seek them out. They'll put you to work. The sooner you aid them, the sooner we can strike. Molto bene, Messere. I accept. It is the right decision. Salute, Rosa. You seem to be healing well. How are you finding Venezia? It has its charms. But how do you deal with the smell? The schifo. So? What brings you to me? I was hoping you could help me with something. And that would be... I want to learn to climb the way you do. Oh. Va bene, I can do that. Well, I can't, but Franco can. Franco! Move il culo! Show Ezio how to reach the top of that scaffolding. Begin in a hanging position. Then jump to the ledge above you. As you reach it, grab it with your hand and pull yourself up. There. See how it works? I think so. Only one way to find out. Try for yourself. Jump, Ezio! So? How did I do? I've seen better. Ah, you wound me with your cruel, cruel words. Please, enter. Your good work has restored us to our former strength, Ezio. We are ready to strike. Just tell me what needs to be done, and I'll see that it is. You'll approach from above under the cover of night. Emilio has posted archers around the palazzo. Kill them, but do so quietly. As they fall, my men shall replace them. What about the guards? When you finish with the archers, we'll regroup in front of this building here, and discuss next steps. Nessun problema. I'll take care of the archers and return to you. Then it's settled. In Bocca al Lupo. Crepi Lupo. Your little house of cards is crumbling, Emilio. A minor setback. It will be dealt with. This povero scemo Antonio and his thieves. Never mind them. It's the assassin you should be worried about. Why? Is... Is he in Venezia? He's been here for weeks. How could you be so blind? Who like you? I've been busy. Someone had to provide the weapons to our... Do not be afraid. I feel no fear, assassin. Only regret. I sought unity. Stability. Order. At too great a cost. Progress demands sacrifice. Non trova alcuna gioia in questo. Ma non c'è altro modo. Requiescat in pace. Sorry, I couldn't resist. Come, let's open the gate for Antonio. Set has fallen and Emilio is no more. All thanks to you, Ezio. Go, tear down Emilio's banners. Return what he has stolen from the people. Tell me, Ezio. How can I repay you for your service? Money's always nice. Easy enough. What else? Emilio was meeting with a man named Carlo. He looked to be a government official. Do you know him? Carlo Grimaldi. He sits on the Council of Ten. Why do you ask? What are you up to? I have a meeting to attend. What is Emilio? I told him to be here. You told him yourself? In person? Yes, myself, in person. I'm concerned that you don't trust me. As am I. Perhaps you'll arrive with the others. Walk with me.
Buongiorno, Cast. Signor Carlo? We thought Emilio would be with you. Emilio is dead. What? How? The assassin. The same one who hunted down the Pazzi. He's here in Venezia. E così? Silvio, did you not know? He could be anywhere. He could be here right now and we might not even know. He struck Emilio inside his own palazzo. And so? What of our plans? There is no longer time for subtlety, my brothers. We must act now. But Marco, I am so close. A few more days, if I can just... No. It happens this week. We should keep moving. Enough with your inane prattle. The choice of Dojo was never up to any of you. And you were never given permission to make plans. Forgive us, Maestro. We wish only to serve. The plan is this. Dojo Mochenigo will fly tonight. And once that it's been done, Marco shall take his place. Vi ringrazio umilmente, Maestro. <coughs> Good. Messer Grimaldi, you are closest to Mocenico. You work the most vital. Serve us well, and it won't be forgotten. Walk with me. Forgive me, Maestro, but is this not perhaps a tad dangerous for you, involving yourself so intimately with the minutiae of our plans? I feel the need to involve myself more directly. The Patsy disappointed us in Firenze. I pray you will not do the same. Do not worry this time. The Patsy were a bunch of foolish... The Patsies were a potent and venerable family, reduced to rubble by one young assassin. Do not underestimate this troublesome foe, who now haunts your city. Or the same fate will befall the Barbarico. I want this done promptly. Bene, I must return to Roma. Time is of the essence. Do not fail us. Antonio! Ezio's here! Ezio, is everything all right? Carlo Grimaldi and the Barbario are in league with the one they call the Spaniard. They're going to murder the Doge and replace him with one of their own. They will have all of Venezia, their entire fleet, in their grasp. And they call me a criminal. Then you'll help me. You have me on your side, brother. And the support of all my men. And women. Grazie, amici. But, Ezio, I must warn you. It's not going to be so easy this time. Palazzo Ducale is the most heavily guarded building in Venezia. Nothing is impenetrable. <laughs> This is why we like you, Ezio. Come, let's go take a look. We'll come up with a plan. Ezio, look! Isn't that him? Grimaldi! Don't you understand what I'm offering you, Signore? Listen to me, please. Or this will be your last chance. How dare you! I'm sorry. Mi dispiace. I meant nothing by it. I'm only looking out for your safety. We're running out of time. There's no way through this fence, and there are guards everywhere. Diablo! Segui me. It's impossible. There's no way in or out for men. Only birds. Yes. Birds. Where are you going now? To see my friend Leonardo. It's time. You did it. It's beautiful. See. Si. Now let's hope your idea works. Because we're nearly out of time. Listen close, Ezio. You're going to want to fly from fire to fire. The heat of each one you pass over should lift you back up in the air again. Bene. Careful, though. There's archers out on the roofs tonight. Avoid those arrows, or it will be a short trip. I wish there was some way I could use my sword while flying these things. <laughs> well, you do have your feet free. If you get close enough without taking an arrow in the head, maybe you could kick them off the building. Nice. It's now or never, amico mio. Ma cos'è? Shoot! Shoot a flying demon!
What's that? Don't worry. Probably just kids with firecrackers. Come, it's your move. Stop! Signore, don't drink that! You are too late. The Doge is dead. What? Carlo? Apologies, Signore. But you should have listened to me when you had the chance. Seems you have failed, assassin. Forgive me, Signore. I tried. Why? What was it all for? Oh. He's killed at the... Ah! It takes one assassin to kill another, it seems. We kill thinking it's best for us. Do we not, Messer Ezio? I do this not for myself. Compio questo sacrificio per il bene superiore. Requiescat in pace. You... You killed me? You killed me?! Why would anyone carry on like that? <laughs> Antonio, we need to talk. Ezio! Ezio Auditore! Theodora, meet the most uh, <coughs> talented man in all of Venezia. Madonna. Ah, Sister Theodora. I never imagined you as a religious type. <laughs> it depends how you understand religion, my son. It's not just men's souls that call for soothing. Come, join us, Ezio. Have a drink. Meet the ladies. <coughs> Murderer! Butcher! He sliced Lucia and stole so, her money! So, Messer Ezio, let's see just how talented you are. After him! Stay back, or I will kill them! <laughs> You have our gratitude, Ezio. Why is it wherever you go, trouble follows? Antonio, I trust you know why I'm here. I imagine to read Venice of Marco Barbarigo. But really, Ezio, we did this once already. And this new Templar Doge is a bigger culo than the last. Never mind that he never leaves the palazzo. Yes, except for tonight. Marco wouldn't dare miss Carnevale. How do you know this? In fact, he's throwing the biggest party of them all. But getting in won't be so simple. You'll need a golden mask for entry. And before you think about forging one, keep in mind, each mask is numbered. Fortunately for you, I have an idea. Let's see if we can't win you a mask. Signore, signore! Come on, come all! The games of Carnevale are about to begin. Do you have the coraggio to compete for as grand a prize as this? This year, like every year, the Golden Mask will provide entry for one, a uno solo, to our most beloved Doge's personal ball. Who would not desire such an exceptional reward? Come, compete! Whoever proves themselves champion in each of four games today shall be the Doge's personal guest tonight. You'd best get through it, Ezio. Like this one thinks himself some kind of campione. Go on, Dante. Show him how sadly mistaken he is. Is there nobody else to 
challenge our man in the ring? Do we have a winner? Ah, uh, we have combatants. So that's how it's going to be, eh? of champions, the wisest strategist, and clearly a favorite of the ladies. With four games won lealmente, the winner of the Golden Mask is... <laughs> the winner of the Golden Mask is Dante Moro. Congratulations. We'll see you this evening. I'm sorry, Ezio. We could not have known Silvio would cheat as he did. <laughs> you should have. Sister, you told us to let you know if we saw that rotting Golo who stole the golden mask. He's on his way to the Doge's party. I will go. I can catch him before he arrives and take back the mask. How? By killing the poor Stronzo? Yes. You know what's at stake. No. If you kill him, they'll cancel the party. And Marco will retreat back into his palazzo. We'll have wasted our time again. Steal the mask instead. Quietly. My girls can help. They're already on their way to the party, all along the route. They can help you distract him while you acquire the mask. Va bene. I can do that. Signore e signori, I present to you the beloved Doge of Venezia. Benvenuti! Welcome, my friends, to the grandest social event of the season. At peace or at war, in times of prosperity or paucity, Venezia will always have carnival! He's not leaving the boat. I will have to swim out there. I wouldn't try it. It would be spotted right away. It's too soon. I'm not ready. We rarely are. Que la morte non sia crudele. Requiescat in pace. Beautifully done. Yes, Que spectacolo. A true hero. You must be exhausted. Come, relax. Ah, the savior of Venezia. What can I say? Perhaps it was wrong of me to doubt so readily. Now, we'll see where all the pieces fall. Enough of that now. You've worked hard, my son. I feel your tired body in need of comfort and succor. But I have such aches and pains, sister. I may need a great deal of comfort and succor. Oh, that can be arranged. Girls! <laughs> Mm. <laughs> oh, 